Welcome to Ithaca, New York, in the heart of the Finger Lakes, home to Cornell University and Ithaca College, a thriving downtown with Ithaca's new city center offering luxury apartments. Ithaca known for its vibrant art and music scene. Downtown you can find hotels or even shop on the famous Ithaca Commons. Of course, Ithaca is gorgeous, home to dozens if not hundreds of waterfalls, gorges, trails, state parks, and more, whether you're a townie or visiting. Of course, they're known for their wine as they sit atop the Finger Lakes wine region. You can also find their own beer at Ithaca Beer Company. Now, in the city of Ithaca, you're not going to see a ton of wildlife, a deer occasionally here and there. But on the outskirts of town, one resident thinks you can see more than just a deer. In fact, meet Ned Huckabee, who claims he saw half man, half antelope. Yep. I, I've been living here, I don't know, my wife and I moved here from uh, Alabama probably uh, 15 years ago. I've been out here all times a day. <laughs> I've been out here drinking White Claw at 5 a.m. and I've been out here, uh, you know, uh, uh, 5 p.m. And I'm gonna tell you, I ain't ever seen anything like this in my life. I've seen deer, I've seen snakes, I've seen birds, I've seen coyote. I ain't never seen anything like this. We decided to catch up with Mitch Roberts at Buttermilk Falls State Park in Ithaca, New York, who's worked there for decades and is an animal specialist. When we told him what Ned Huckabee said, he quoted, What the f did he say? A what? Mitch takes pride in being the GM of the state park and doesn't hold back. I've been working at Buttermilk for decades. Let's just say I'm the butter to the milk. <laughs> or the milk to the butter. You get it. Mitch, being an animal expert, has never heard of the mantelope, but won't rule it out. Mantelope, I gotta look it up. I mean, I'm, I like to believe I'm one with the animals here. I, I, I love it here. Um, I'll tell you, if there is a mantelope, I'm real disappointed I didn't get to meet him. <laughs> Ned spent most of the afternoon showing us over and over again exactly what happened, repeating himself over and over. In my yard, uh, pruning the hedges. You know, Kathy's running around in the kitchen with the kiddos and cleaning the Keurig. She loves to clean that damn thing. And I gotta tell you, man, all of a sudden, out of nowhere, I see this thing, right? It's got skin, it's got hair. It's got everything a man has except got these long antlers and we locked eyes and he looked at me like this which was awkward because he was peeing <laughs> so now we're locked eyes he's a urinating and I said uh, you're in trouble <laughs> see what I'm doing there we also tried to catch up with Ned's neighbor Chip Whitley who is a Cornell professor who came out with his pants off said he'd be right back shut the door and literally never came back. I just want to tell you all the news, and everybody downtown, and everybody around here, I just want everyone to stay safe. Look, we are a tight-knit community, albeit all houses are probably about at least a quarter of a mile away from each other, but either way, we are tight-knit. That thing comes back, I got a pellet gun with his name on it. This thing I just got off eBay, smoking deal. It was like, 80 bucks included shipping. It's got scope. 800 feet per second. So, let's just hope that the antelope, mantelope, is within 800 feet. There's a lot more than people know about old Ned Huckabee. <laughs> Listen, I'm out there every day trying to be one with nature. I don't want to hurt animals. I love animals. I'm out there sometimes. And I'm bird watching. Maybe I'm, maybe I'm, I'm, I'm feeding. I'm feeding the birds, or, or sometimes, sometimes I'm even doing calls. Look out! Look out! I know what I saw. This thing was a mantelope. I promise to keep everybody safe, and I just want to raise awareness. That's all old Ned Huckabee ever has been about. Nature, love, and a white cloth. It tastes like shit, though. Channel 9, Dan Miller.